teman-teman netizen saya sore ini dapat tamu yang luar biasa dan sangat spesial namanya Ibu Yute Galikas dia sudah 50 tahun membantu kita mengurus orang hutan di Kalimantan Bu Yute Why you? Good? Yeah, I'm back to Japan. Yeah, terima kasih. Can you tell us the story of your journey uh, within 50 years? Uh, well, my journey started when I was a child. And what happened is that I saw pictures of orangutans. Right. And they mesmerized me. And the reason they mesmerized me is that their eyes were like the eyes of humans. Mm. Their eyes mirrored our own. And wow. so yeah. I was there was in particular there was a picture of an orangutan, the sub adult male, probably from Sumatra, and if you looked at him above the lips, he could have been human. When I was a graduate student at UCLA, University of California at Los Angeles, I went up to the late great paleoanthropologist, Louis Leakey, and I asked him for his help to get me started on an orangutan study. And the whole process from when I went up to Louis Leakey to when I actually arrived in Indonesia was three years of waiting. Now, for me at my age, it's not a problem, three years and blink of an eye. But in, uh, at the time, Yeah, when you're in your yeah. early 20s, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's forever. I thought I'd never get to Indonesia, but I did. And uh, Pasinaga, who was the director of... Pak Daniel, uh, no, Pasinaga is the director, eh? Wa Walmansnaga. Well, yeah, yeah right. Pak Walmansnaga, please remember this 50 years ago. Yeah. Uh, Pak Walman said, I wanted to go to Sumatra, but Pak Walman said, no, 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 he said, you are the type of person who wants to be the first. Mm. He said, and they, he had just sent some people to Sumatra to study orangutans. Yeah. So he said, I will send you to Kalimantan. So who was I to argue with him? <laughs> who did help you from from here, from the faculty? Yeah. Are there any student also company you at the time? Not at the time. Mm. But about three years later, uh, we started having uh, students from UNAS. Mm, right. And over the years, Uh, I have supervised over a hundred students from UNAS. Who also are studying orangutan? Yeah, some of them have actually done, not, not so much studying orangutans, but studying uh, conservation issues. Conservation, yeah. yeah what, did, what did you do at the first time, right in the jungle? I went out and I searched for orangutans, so I chari. So hari penuh dari pagi sampai sore. Di, di mana itu di di daerah di Tanjung Puting? Ya, yeah, di Tanjung Puting. Waktu itu suaka marga satu masih ya? Ya. Yeah. Yeah. Waktu itu belum. Uh, Ada faun orang hutan, faun orang hutan dan? Well, it took a long time sometimes. Yeah. Uh, one time I had to search 20 days yeah. before I found one. Wow. Uh, question for myself: How you can manage your your patient? Until now, it's a 50 years of working on orangutan. What is your your dream at the time, and then whether your dream come true right now? Who will it be? Well, it's almost come true. Almost, almost come true, yeah. Yeah, almost come true. Yeah. Uh, I have been very, very fortunate that um, orangutans are found in Indonesia, and I was very fortunate that I came here, and I was very fortunate in the support that I received here. Yeah. So far, how many you have a rehabilitation center, right? Yes. And how can you get the the, the budget for that? Um, again, I'm very fortunate. We established uh, a foundation in the United States. Yeah. And it was tough going initially, but uh, over the years we have built it up. And people are quite concerned about conservation. People are quite concerned about. Uh, the environment in the United States, and we now have a small foundation in Australia and a small foundation in Canada. So basically, virtually all our funding comes from uh, from you know foreign sources, not from Indonesia. 
Uh, although there are people, individuals in Indonesia who have given us funding. Uh, <laughs> at one point we even received a little uh, money from Apa uh, Itu, um, Dana Taktis, mm. uh, from mm. the governors of yeah. Kalimantan Tenga. To support your activities. Dana Taktis, from yeah. their Dana Taktis. And actually we once received money directly from the, uh, uh, the forestry minister. I mean, just like personal. Mm. And also, personal support, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. also, uh, Pa Sumitro, Jojo Hadikusumo, who is now sort of Wapat. Yeah, Pa Sumitro also support yeah. you. Yeah, he yeah, yeah. his own money. So, if I look at this picture, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah this is you, and this is the Louis Leakey. Louis Leakey. And, and that is Rodman. This is, and this one? Rodman Dumont, my first husband. Yeah, and the Louis Leakey is your mentor at the time, yeah? Yeah, he's right. the one that found the sponsorship from the National Geographic. He's the one who found yeah. the sponsorship from the Leakey Foundation. Yeah. And he is the one that helped me get a visa to come to Indonesia. How do you look at this, the future of orangutan, especially in Kalimantan? What do you think about the future of it? Well, I think if the government continues to protect orangutans and forests, then the orangutans have a future. But if they don't, then orangutans don't have a future. Yes, the government is, uh, is this, uh, the, the strong point for this, right? The well, policy government. of the government. Yes, absolutely. Right? absolutely. Uh, how the, the community in the U.S. looking at this uh, orangutan now, if compared to 50 years ago, are there any concern for them? Still? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Right. Absolutely. Well, you know, 50 years ago, we didn't understand anything. I mean, uh, Pasinaga told me that there were people that claimed that there were only 3,000 orangutans left in Kalimantan. Who do you think? When? 50 years ago? 30 years ago, yeah. Yeah. So, Abu Burute is the last example. It is, sees the example of how strong mm -hmm. commitment of this woman to, to orangutan, meaning that also uh, protecting the, their habitat, meaning protecting the forest. That's right. And all the, 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 the benefit from the forest because oh. of we protect orangutan. Yeah, if you don't have forest, orangutans cannot survive. Can you give us uh, one word or one message for, for us in Indonesia for orangutan or protection of the uh, farmer? Save the forest and plant trees, native trees. Native trees. Yeah, plant native trees and protect forest. Thank you, Ibu Gurute, for a very uh, incredible discussion. Teman-teman netizen, terima kasih staff dari Taman Nasional dan KSDA untuk selalu bekerja seperti Ibu Gurute. Very consistent. Almost uh, now, uh, this year, it's been 50 years of working on orangutan. Sampai jumpa lagi.